Someone always has to carry the pain. Now it's your turn, sister. This time she's at the centre of the story. Um, and, uh, and I think it's important to kind of to, to, to view her character always, really, as opposed to just now. I think it's, she's always been popular. I, I think what's really important, at least for me, is like to really make a movie like this one, having a female character at the front, but treating her in a way that Hollywood rarely does. And I think it's more than ever now, I think the audience are ready for that. Um, and and that, that was crucial. Now is a good time because I think the world finally caught up with Lisbeth. <laughs> uh, having a, a, a female lead hero character uh, is very up to date to what's happening. And now, now you have Lisbeth and my kids can watch her. She's not physically strong. Um, you know, she gets told her whole life that she's very weak. You're watching her do these fights and, and I'm not doing anything kind of really strong in that sense. I'm, I'm just fighting for my life and I'm kind of um, clawing on to the last possible moment. And so that says a lot about her character, I think. Character in the books got a bit, a bit more action-y and even the stories, the stakes got higher. It was, it was great to see Claire doing that because she'd never done that before, right? So suddenly, but she's so devoted to her craft that you can see her training and being ready to do those things and being doing pretty shops on set all the time. It has a lot of uh, action in it and uh, and it, it's the kind of film you want to see on a big screen. She's more mature now, she's, she's slightly older than the first time you saw it. This is not a 20 year old like Lisbeth Sander. Um, and that's something also that I find it very interesting to see where did she go. She's trying to have a life and now oof, it's bad people come in and stop her from it. A lot of it is based on the book but um, you know m most of my kind of work and research was on the previous three books. They were the things that I really included and wanted to focus on for the character. You know one thing is very important it's a very loose adaptation of the books in keeping in mind that we respect the storyteller and respect this bit as a character and want to honor that character. It really stands on its own and you don't have to have read the books or seen the movies before to, to enjoy it but it's still the, the Millennium Universe and, and the characters go on. I know what she's capable of. We're running out of time.